Hello and welcome to the African Crap of, of nations. nations. Yeah, we want me to complete that one no, there. No, I didn't. I was okay. just pausing for dramatic effect, but All that's right. okay. Comoros versus South Sudan this afternoon evening. We've got a great game. We had two great games yesterday. We uh, did. We had a fabulous start to the I was thrilled by that, by that start. No boring football. Both teams on the front foot. Not but boring like football. Bad football. Into, bad not football. Boring. Not boring. <laughs> nope. Not necessarily boring all the time. This is two teams that are probably the worst two teams in the group. So a win here would be massive for one of these teams. Well, yeah. A win's always massive in a tournament. With only well, yeah. And the opening games. game, and I'm just saying, when you're playing against an opponent that you would perceive you can beat... You yeah, know, winning the game here would be because both of them are going to play Cape Verde at some point. We've got another view of that nice corner flag, and we're in the new stadium. What, what stadium are we in today, James? We are in the Stad Gatan Duval Stadium. Sir Gatan Duval. Wonder who he is. Sir Gatan Duval. So we've got the the white kits on. Of South Sudan. South Sudan. The away kits. They will meet Sudan. Yes. Oh, it's the last group game. That will be an absolute thriller. Right? Yeah, it's coming up. I hope so. I hope there's something to play for. So I'm hoping for. I'm going to say it right here, right now. I'm hoping for a South Sudan win here, so they have something to play for in that game against Sudan. Well, I've just seen a, a banner in the crowd there that said "fuck Sudan." So oh, okay, no worries. So here's Comoros. Oh, a full team of faces there. Nordin Iburoy, Clinton Mata, Yusuf, Ayal Dasana. I've heard good things about Alifa, that Yusuf. Sule. And now what? South Sudan side. No faces, no more two faces. Dominic Patino has a face. James Mulder. Up front there. Only four substitutes today. I mean, you can only use three, but they don't have much choice there. They don't. What do you think of this stadium? It's quite a nice venue. Carlsberg all the way around. Not banned in this country. It's... it's The sponsorship well, of... Uh, why would it be banned? Because it's a great beverage. Let's have a look around the stadium here, see what we can see before this game kicks off. Uh, I we saw see. a fuck. I can't see anymore, but I did see a fuck Sudan. Okay. Dingy. Um, just talk amongst yourselves for a minute. Right. <laughs> right. Um, that should be fine. So we'll get to the action. Action. That's this game. Kicks off. Adam Asana. Clinton Matter. The kids still clash a little bit. They do, uh, slightly. I think uh, I think the Comoros, oh. Comoros national team blends into the uh, Clinton Matter. Oh, that oh, was was an opening save. That was, a, that was a fabulous start from Clinton Matter. Kind of pushed off the ball there, stays up with it, keeps going, keeps going, still going, can't be stopped, and the goalkeeper is forced to make the save. I think that was going to hit the post, but his team won't mind. They've won a corner. Back post, headed in. Oh, Cleared off, off the, the line. Balls. Off the line, Unbelievable. yeah. Unbelievable. Najib Abdu, the man who used to play for Millwall. Yeah. Millwall legend Najib Abdu playing there. Out there. Millwall legend. He is. Millwall legend Najib Abdu. Scored against Leeds in the 2008 playoffs. He must be a veteran. Yes, it's a goal! goal! What a great goal that was! Wow. That absolutely came out of nowhere! It did indeed. Dominic Pratino. With Dominic Pratino! Another really shot. Like, uh, what? Like, I thought Comoros started the game fabulously well. Drew the save from the goalkeeper, then had it drawn off the line, didn't they? It was kicked off the line. Yeah. It was kicked off the line, and Pratino just hits one and. End to end. South Sudan have the lead in this game. They're happy, aren't they? I mean, why? No, why wouldn't you be? Why not? Kids are lovely. I love the South Sudan kids. Oh, do, yeah, it's nice, isn't it? It's kind of Peru-like with that strip. Like he bypasses his man. Oh, sort of with the outside, outside of his foot. Yeah. What a fabulous effort that Up the green, their sign says. I presume that must be for uh, Comoros. Comoros, yes. And it came out of nowhere. That looked it really turned. did. And then yeah, really, we were just discussing the Jim Abdu, the former Millwall man. And then that goal... There's the opening goal of this game. Oh, there's a sign there that says Mighty Abdu. No, oh, right, he must be go. a star on, in this team. Obviously, the commentators knew that. The Jim Abdu very much. Mighty Abdu. One of the only players you may know. In Chiranga, seems to be not in the stand line. He was formerly of old and athletic. Who's it? Oh, 
Oh, he bypasses him. Oh, oh well, this well. game has something going on with it. I'm enjoying it so far. Kamitz. Neither team willing to slow the pace down either. It's end to end still. James Mulga. A tackle. We haven't seen one of them. All the possession changes have been because of shots. The buoy. Is that a penalty? The goalkeeper says no. Oh, that, what? Well, I'd like another look at that. Well, maybe we'll get one. Or probably not, though, because it wasn't given. Here's Clinton Matter now. He gets tackled. Did you know the man with the goal? We're 11 minutes in now. It feels like we're 85 minutes in. Such is the intense start we've had to this football match. Sule. He is Ibu Roy. Clean Ooh. through. He shot. Oh, oh, my word. That was... Oh, that will be on all the highlight reels. That was absolutely embarrassing from Abu Ray. Well, I don't even know what he was trying to do there. Did you think the goalkeeper coming out kind of... It scared him, didn't it? It fooled him, didn't yeah. it? Gah, he says. Gah. Gennaro. Gennaro, the goalkeeper, yeah. Gennaro, he would say. But that was good goalkeeping, to be fair to him. He come out, scare the attacker. We have attacker. to. We yeah. have to do that. You just have to do that. David Danner. Well intercepted there. This this comp this South Sudan's team, sorry. Really. Ending up being the favourites now. Playing really well. Although they're not as sure, I don't think, since they scored. But I think they've been opened up a bit easily there. From Clinton Mate. Leon Kamitz. I wonder what the climate is out there. Is it really cold? It, oh, it will be. It will be very, very humid and difficult for many of them. They'll be used to this, though. Sudan and Comoros located sort so of on the east coast of Africa, more towards. David. Comoros are very familiar with this climate, being an island nation not too far away from Mauritius. Oh, Clinton Matter has just. Absolutely fluffed his lines there. The man who had that early shot could have opened the scoring after a minute, couldn't he? Could have, yeah. Game slowing down. Finally slowing down. Uh, I think, yeah. Uh, but here we go, here we go. No. Struggling to find their breath. Ooh. Almost. The ball's just ping ponging between anyone who'll touch it. It's a soaking atmosphere. Fabulous atmosphere in the stadium, isn't it? Ooh. That player there looks like they're reacting hurt, to that. No! Oh, oh, right right in from instinct save there from the goalkeeper. We couldn't see anything because of the camera angle, but let's have a look at this again. In front. He's been a good player, hasn't he, Clinton Mate? Comes out, goalkeeper makes a good save. He had to. Just made himself big and it hit him. That's all you have to do. He's proud of that one. Look at him. He He's is. chuffed his chips. Not that one, Dean. Oh, James. Like that one. Oh, chuffed his chips. Yes. How do you take... Pleased um, as punch. Pleased as punch. Just a basic I have no idea how you Just a basic cross, isn't it? Have any scores? Oh, oh, oh. he almost got an think family score, despite knowing not what to do there. The boo Roy. The man who... He might scare himself. I didn't press anything for that to happen. Okay. Just, uh, simply circling back then. All right. So you like the fabulous drummer Gennaro. Mm, that was humped that one, didn't it? James Morgan. I look, Akesh. Akesh finds Luau. Oh! oh! Only just wise. Well, that wasn't half close, was it? Poorly done by the defender there. Couldn't get it away. Well found. Oh, yeah, it was cheeky that to flick it up for himself. Very well done. Yeah, it was nice, wasn't it? Some good cut football on display at times. At times, I would say. Most of the time, it's pretty poor. But we've seen some good goals, haven't we, in this tournament so far? <laughs> some screens, yeah. Oh. Oh, playing it backwards was a bit scary there, wasn't it? Bit of a risk to take. Seems we've got away with it though. 
Cross in. Too deep for anyone to get on the win. And that's going to go out for a goal kick. The world doing. Another long kick from that goalkeeper and it flicked on again. They're just trying to get themselves about, aren't they? Just the sack the south suddenly on the training ground. <laughs> that was a cheeky little pass. Look at the space he's found in his own. Couldn't matter. Oh, what an awful pass. But it finds its way to Ibu Roy. Yusuf. Salamani. Come on! in! Akinswoy was offside, but the referee no. says it counts. Well, you know, they don't have the... They don't have VAR in this tournament. They just don't have the the capabilities to look back at these uh, incidents. I uh, can't see the far hand side there, so you just cannot tell who's on the side or not. You've got to assume he is probably your best chance of getting the angle to see whether he is on the side. He is. He must have got played on side by the fella here. Yes, he must have been. He equalises. Yeah. Commonwealth level. It's 1-1. One, one. And the grass, I must say, is looking extra luscious. It's looking alright, isn't it? It works it's much better than the, uh, the, the, mo- the Malaysian the, grass. The Malaysian grass. Oh, the last tournament we did. Oh! Swings Fantastic well. save. Right, I thought he was going to spin around in front of, back, in, back in front of him, but the camera angle kind of fooled me there. It spins away. Goalkeeper standing up well there. Great spin. Goalkeeper stands up well. Turns it away. Corner now. For South Sudan. Whipped in. Headed. Over the bar. Oh, only just over. Well, quite a way over, but he managed to get his head on it. What have you thought of the game so far? It's been a, it's a very high good. octane fixture. That's a good way to describe it, James. End to end. High octane. Exciting. Everything you want to see in a tournament football match, isn't it? Yeah, and it's 1 1. Oh. Oh, no, he yeah. twatted him in the head. <laughs> he did. Referee not so willing to give free kicks to this guy. This referee will be invisible, might he? Doing his refereeing it well. Well, we saw an early yellow, didn't we? Or was that the other game? That was the last game. Yeah, so referee's just been. Ali Al Madden. I do all that. Oh, that was an awful pass, wasn't it? I'm seeing to lose the ability to read these names. Doesn't it matter? I got tackled by his own teammate again. Y- oh, Yusuf. Dominic Pretino. James Mulder. And we've got only a few seconds left now in the half. This will be the last attack. A look, a cash. A cash. Oh, Later, it's, it's early for South Sudan <laughs> and Luau attack Luau attack Luau and didn't he he certainly attacked that football oh, wow fantastic Little great flip. celebration yeah. and Gennaro just claps him delighted with that you've got to say though what were what were Cornwall's doing they couldn't deal with a touch could they on this wing here runs through can't deal with him and what, what is the number four doing? What on earth are they all what doing? What are they all doing? What on earth is happening there? Awful defending. It was the worst goal of the tournament, that one. Nice deal, nice to see the, the player open, but... Touches it over, and it's 2-1 South Sudan. And horrible defending. Would you say that's the best celebration of the tournament oh, so far? For sure. Great stuff. Right. That game ended as soon as that goal went in. That half that's ended, right. sorry. I think we've been trekked to a... Would you say game of the tournament so far? Come on, South Sudan. We get, well, there's been so many good games, it's hard to say that. But I, it, it has been very good, hasn't it? I've enjoyed it very much. And look, Comoros having more of the possession there. Yeah, Comoros, more I possession, more I think the big thing to take shots. away from modern football is that, though, possession... It's not the most important statistic anymore at all, is it? It's it never has more been. productive possession, isn't it, really? And Possession's never been the most important statistic, James. The most important statistic is the one that begins with Well, G. yes, yeah, but I mean, in terms of all the other statistics, because obviously the goals is a statistic, but... Uh, 
Obviously the most important, yes. Yes, the only one that counts for anything. It is, it is. Second half, do we see changes? Oh, I Substitutions, maybe? Or yeah, anything like that? Potentially, we could see it. Well, we can see they're both teams playing very centrally. Could we see wingers coming on, trying to exploit I'm the... surprised with the... Uh, with that. I mean, Clinton Matter has been fabulous. I mean, he had that opening strike and then he, he had a couple of good crosses in. I'm surprised he has not seen... Uh, I'm surprised that percentage of the, on the wing of his side is so low. So we just... Having a look here at the teams. Comoros making a couple of changes we're hearing down from the uh, sideline. Our touchline reporter. Yep, our touchline reporter who is... Um, I don't know who he is. Peter Mabenga. Right, Peter Mabenga is down there. Yes. Should Peter. we just get on with the second half? We will. And we'll try and get... <laughs> Well, we'll try and get the teams changed again. Hopefully. Well done there. To get the teams changed. Oh, wrong way. So we have had two changes, but I don't know if they've, if they've come up yet. But basically... Comoros have tried to bring in a bit of a bit. And they've brought in two more attacking wingers. See if they can exploit down the, the left-hand side a bit better. And they couldn't there. They could expose themselves, couldn't they, going that way? Morga. Oh, Morga's done well there. He's done very well. He's done extremely well. Oh, I was just ready to shout goal or... gasping... Surprise there, Matia Mulder, Sana, Clinton Matta. Here's Comoros. Ooh, dangerous track tackles going in now. I don't know why, because they're leading the game. That would be cynical and disgusting from the South Sudanese. Do a good job. Remarkable Sudan have been able to fall aside for this tournament. Oh, it's a oh, goal! Oh, oh. It is a goal! Oh, what a hash of it they made of it. Did uh, Comoros. And I tackle well. I tackle well this second. <laughs> Every game so far. I've seen a man with two goals. He did a backflip as well, so we've got a. Yeah, so we've got the goal here. Yeah. Great save from the goalkeeper. He couldn't do nothing about that. That was a well placed volley. He could have took a touch, but Do you then... think somebody should have been out there tracking him, making sure he couldn't get that rebound? I don't know how somebody you has to think Somebody that. has to ha help the goalkeeper out there. Was that smart? Well, that smart strike work, wasn't it, really? Look at him just peeling off there. He realised there's a potential for a rebound. I don't think there. there's any way you can defend that. Because then you're just man-marking him. Yes. That, oh, it yeah, never ends it's well. It's very confusing, yes. South Sudan 3. Comoros won. This game is turning into a rout. What, what game we had early on was totally different in the second half. Mm, they made a quick goal. As I was saying, South Sudan getting a team ready for this game. They've been locked in the Civil War for several years. Do you think it's amazing they've been able to get a side together? Um, <laughs> yes. Yeah. Well, uh, what we notice about all these African nations is they're in political strife. You know... To bring football to these nations is really uplifting them. Salamani cuts inside. Couldn't find a Bouri though. Not the the goal scorer. I really like how James Mulga drops deep and tries to make himself available at all times. But they're really squeezing on you those. Comoros defenders. As soon as you get the ball anywhere near the edge of the box, they just hound you. Took a jock. There's James Morga. <laughs> that was going to be a cheeky ball, but it was well intercepted. 
Bis Clinton Matte. Oh, passes it to Asana. Back to Clinton Matte. The number 77, what a large number for a jersey. Very familiar in American sports. That large number. Said to be a big fan of offensive tackles. Is Clinton Matter? Well, of course, I, I jest, he is not. Right. I suppose, I suppose he's called Clinton, which is American. Isn't it? Um, I, don't know. I guess it's a bit like Clinton and G, the man who used to go for Tottenham. Not Bill Clinton, the president. That's a surname, though, isn't it? You can name someone after a surname, James. Here's a look at Kesh. Well, it's Senna Proctor, the racing driver named after Ainton Senna. Well, James Morgan! Saved. Great save. What Good on earth? Hell. Why did he do that? <laughs> he almost had it in his own net. Remarkable. I thought James Morgan was offside there. James Morgan, keeper save. Keeper save that fall into his knees. That's what you do. Yes, a very similar style of save that I made there. Yep. James Morgan whips this one in. The header. Wide. Hmm. Don't know why you're looking like that. I'm not looking like anything. You looked at me with a look of confusion. James Morgan there. 14 passes, 12 minutes. I really like James yeah, Morgan. Yeah, me too. I think he's possibly my man of the match in this game. You know he hasn't scored two? I don't care. You did say that in the last I game. I did, but... <laughs> I mean, I did think Andy Sophie had played better than Luau has in this game. They have just been finishers from Luau, haven't they, really? Yeah, they have been. Got to be there, though, don't you? Duke Jock. Not Duke Jock, face Salamani. Salamani! He's passing a second as well! And he gets them back into the game. Two, three, and he wants to get this second, this goal, this game back underway. Faye Selmani. We've got four players tied at the top. Oh, what a fabulous goal scoring chart. Yeah, I mean, it's only two goals, so it's it anyone's game, really. But it is. He's giving all the space of Mauritius there to just go yeah. forward and hammer it in the back of the net. With Mauritius, James. What, sorry? Mauritius. Did I say Mauritius? You said Mauritius. Yeah, I said he's got all the space in Mauritius to... to oh, I thought, you, I thought you confused the... Uh, no, no, the I, was, I, was, I was saying it's the whole of the nation. island in Mauritius to, to... That ball is beautiful, I love it. Yeah, it's very nicely selected there. They've got ten minutes to get back into the game, haven't they? Here's James Morgan. James Morgan gets his goal that I would say gives him the man of the match performance. Well, he is the captain, isn't he? So he led this team he well. Has, he has captained this team. To glory. To victory. Maybe glory in the future in terms of winning this tournament. <laughs> yes. South Sudan. He just ran in a straight line, didn't he? And then neatly took that one away. Some clever passing about though to get him in such a position. It was, and the hearts of Commerce are broken. Well placed, well timed. Good goal after they just got themselves back into the game. 4 2, so many goals. A great game. The fans have been given the hands of Gennaro. Gennaro Gattuso. Nope, that's not right. That was his name. Oh, could he have he fell there and well, won a penalty? Uh, he's definitely called for it from the crowd. I think he's staying on his feet and being honest there kind of cost him. Oh, that's a red card. Oh, that is a... He, oh, that was disgusting. That's a red card. It's not, it's a yellow. Well, this what referee. a lenient referee. This referee. I don't know why he's arguing there. How late was that? Shocking. Well, David Dada booked. He was lucky to get away with that one, wasn't that? Jimmy Abdu, yeah. miles over the line. I don't think that was any good. It was a good conversion if we were playing rugby. 
Yeah, you're right there. James Milner. Oh, he, he won a second there. He did, he won again in the act, didn't he? Morgan! Oh. Just the four minutes remaining. Here's Morgan again. Oh, oh just wide. narrowly wide. Swings out his arm in frustration he there. He fancies himself today. He does. Lovely turn, though. Really, really could have done better there with the finish after that turn. Twenty-eight touches, four more than a tackle. Well, he's really having a game. He's a man who's coming in deep to get the ball, isn't he? James Moore, I mean, he's everywhere. Coming to the end of this game. Here he is again, James Morgan. James Morgan running out of energy. Doesn't matter at all. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter at all. Oh, the shot really deserved better. It did. The work right there. And it's over. And that's it. South Sudan 4, Comoros 2. Yes. South Sudan getting a big win there and they looked like a good side, didn't they? Well, South Sudan look unbelievable. If 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 we if we're saying that, yeah. So, can't argue with that. Four goals. Can't argue with that at all. You can't argue with Clinton that. Clinton matter. He surged forward in the opening minute, not touched at all, forced away by Gennaro. You talk us through these highlights, just for this minute. Well, that. And then Dominic Patino out of nowhere. Comoros made a fabulous start, and then this goal skips inside. What a fabulous finish that was. Outside of... It feels like a lifetime ago, that goal. <laughs> Gives them a lead after five minutes. I tackle Al with the assist on that one. Attack. I don't know why you're struggling to pronounce that word. What am I saying? I tack. I tackle Al. I tackle Al. I don't know. I think I, I'm overcomplicating the pronunciation because I think they, they are complicated, but they're not. Yusuf. The, oh, what a great save. Straight that at was. the keeper, though. Yeah, you've got to stand up well, though, don't you? You do. Attack. Attack, yeah. We will we'll see him later on the highlights because he gets himself a couple of goals, doesn't he? He does. Yusuf forcing a save from Gennaro there. Straight his chest. Here he is. Attack Lowell. And he certainly attacked the goal, didn't he? Kick the ball. Oh, well, he had a shot there. His goal will come up eventually. Oh, here's the equaliser from Fai Selmani. Yusuf with the assist there. He's been getting himself around. He has. Maybe we thought they'd go. Here we go. Here's your boy. Your boy, James Morgan. <laughs> oh, beautifully turned. <laughs> he is fantastic, James Morgan. He is. He looks great, doesn't he? He looks so well. Well... Well worth being captain of this Salterdon side. And then Pratino with the header over. And here he is. The goal. <laughs> that was a poacher's goal. Oh, it was, but you've got to get yourself in there, don't you? That's what he... he, he I, it never is a name being more appropriate. <laughs> he just, he just, he's always there. Look at him. There he is again. Yep. Just right place, right time. You've got to have that kind of player. I and mean, he can afford to be that when James Mulder is the man who creates him. Yeah. I mean, can we criticise the goalkeeper? I think it was a good save. I, I just don't think you can. Can you hold on to that? How do you prevent that it's goal? It's just unlucky that it's fell. How would you prevent that goal? Right at the feet of Attack Lowell. James Mulder giving an opportunity to score here. Ooh, that was a great a strong that right was a good save and then well, we don't actually see it on the replay but uh, coming up with it and hammering it over the bar was one of the defenders <laughs> and, and attack Lowell, I don't yeah. remember that but attack Lowell nearly got a hat trick he did 
Fire Solomani with a double. Great shot into the corner there. I think it was an underrated goal, that. I think if that had really a goal to give them the lead... It was OK, yeah. Would have we, would have we picked that up a bit more? Maybe. He doesn't seem to agree with that one. It was a bit of a hit and hope type moment. James Mulgaard. Ah, what a beautiful finish. That was much better, wasn't it? The captain. He placed that one. And then he pointed at someone and laughed at them. Mm, could have seen more for that? Well, we should be seeing a red, really. He shouldn't be playing the next game, but he will be. So there you go. Southampton coming up with a 4-2 victory. It puts pressure on their neighbour, Sedan, who will have to put up a good performance against Cape Verde Island. That's a good point, yeah. We've got the South Sedan-Sedan rivalry coming up. And as I said before the game, I want to see Sedan win this game. So that game, South Sedan v Sedan, final game, may mean something, and it it could well do. You have to feel for Comrus, though. They they really don't deserve to lose. They started the game brightly. I think they did deserve to lose in the end. Well, they did deserve to lose. I think they did. I think they had a good start, and then they sort of fell off. The the actual match ratings that we see have attacked Luau as man of the match. Okay, right. Um, James Mogo only rated a seven. Only rated a seven, yeah. I think he'd scored that second goal, he would be rated man of the match. I think, I think goals give you a rating quite a boost. They do, so, they do. Yeah. We had we only had the one substitute at half-time and it was Feu's Ataman who got an assist. Atamane, yes. Atamane came on and got an assist. Um, he did, he played the ball into Feu's Selimani. So there you go, yeah. A nice little game there. We've got one more today, which is... It will be Sudan Sudan. versus Cape Verde Islands, I believe. Cape Verde Islands, the favourites. The best team, apparently. They were, well, they did reach the 2013 African Combinations quarterfinals. Right. So that will be it then, I suppose. Yeah. Au revoir.